Adult learners don't learn by watching someone run through slides and talk at them. They are best uh, taught through interactive, engaging exercises. So we run through a number of scenarios, leveraging videos, having them uh, fill out worksheets that help them craft their story, not just the story that they want to tell, but to learn how to frame that message to the lawmaker or the office that they'll be talking to. Right after the follow fly in experience or the advocacy day experience, you know, there is a survey to be completed on your experience or your team's experience. It's very important that they get feedback from every single advocate, good, bad, or indifferent about each meeting. The other thing about online meetings that we're seeing is you can use them to leverage other opportunities. So for example, let's say you have a board meeting at a conference and you want to have those board members, you know, talk to the legislators, but you don't always want to fly them to DC. Um, have that board have, you know, special time where they're going to talk to their legislators virtually. Um, and that way you're combining two things and not having to create two different kinds of events. I like the uh, the point you made about the constituent mail too, because that's something that you can kind of help facilitate on the ad advocacy front using tools like Voter Voice to ensure that there are a lot of uh, messages coming in prior to the meeting and then also after the meeting, almost staging the different acts of the play.